slowly working to perfection. I don't know if y'all can tell the difference, but we got a dark, darker coloration here, and we got that warm, um, for lack of a better term, it's like a nutty brown color. Anyone who's made their own roux knows that lovely rich smell that it smells the whole house up with like a it's like a nutty smell um, reminds me of fall or walnuts or pecans kind of smell smells great smells like home smells like Sundays at mom and dad's darker ever darker gotta walk away from it and sit down for two minutes let it bubble up like that a little dark and stir it and it gets ever more brown Ooh, that's hot Let's see. beautiful dark layer under there I'm gonna mix that in and make it even darker beautiful brown color going on right now it's like a chocolate looks like chocolate i'm just gonna this is some flour just so you can compare the darkness and this is the dangerous part you have to be very careful when it's like this you gotta keep on stirring keep on stirring because it could burn at this point in scorch and you don't want that not something that you want to fall on your bare skin because it will burn you to the bone and um the word rue actually is a french word and um, it was brought to us by our french ancestors that came to louisiana and it means red rue means red um i guess for this um uh, we could describe this color we have going on here it's like a reddish brown chocolatey color and it smells amazing like walnuts doing this for about the past 45 minutes i want to say um you need patience to work on this and now we're about to make the precarious transition rinsed out that pot for the most part with water this is the water from the the excess roux and we're gonna save that for later boo remember this take them out now because I don't want to fry them all the way I still want them to have that juice locked in there so we're not going to cook them all the way through it's still going to be a little pink at this point just for this stage okay at this point the sauce from scratch begins clean pot all right remember that spare water we had we're going to utilize that now the meatballs that back in to make some meat juice that we're gonna add in later this is just water that the meatballs have been rolling around in and stewing in for a little bit uno i tasted it and it is hot and delicious start that sauce up crochet next gotta put that paste Got that paste going making that sauce We'll add some of this now. This stuff is so good, by the way. Check it out. It's like Rotel on steroids. Just have to put the rest in later for flavor. Cook this in there now, so we can infuse with the sauce. Fun port next. This is gonna be the hottest. Check out this consistency now and this. How dark red that is. Spare juice.
Try something new. Hmm. We're gonna see if there's anybody watching this right now. I'm gonna need y'all to call the doctor because I'm fixing to hurt myself.